Heads up. What you got? Hancock. Hey, when you got time, I... I got something I still need you to hear. Is everything all right? Oh, yeah. Better than that. This is just... tricky. It's just... being out here with you, it's made me realize... most of my life to this point... I've been running out on the good things I got. I skipped out on my family, my life in Diamond City. Took up with you just to get out a good neighbor. Hell, running from myself is what made me into... into a damn ghoul. But being here with you for the first time in my life, things have just felt... right. And running is the furthest thing from my mind. I mean, I left Good Neighbor thinking I was gonna just sharpen up the old killer instinct. But whether it's fate, or destiny, or just goddamn coincidence, I ended up with someone like you. I turned one of the nastiest settlements in the Commonwealth into a refuge for the lost. I thought I'd done something I could hang my hat on. But being out here with you, it's made me realize just how small time I'd been thinking. And that maybe all my running, for my life, myself, Maybe it wasn't such a bad thing after all. Running from yourself? What do you mean? Well, I mean, I didn't always look this good. The drug that did this to me, that made me a ghoul, I knew what it was going to do. I just couldn't stand looking at the bastard I saw in the mirror anymore. The coward who'd let all those ghouls from Diamond City die. I was too scared to protect his fellow drifters from Vic and his boys. If I took it, I'd never have to look at him again. I could put that all behind me. I'd be free. Didn't seem like a choice at all. Turns out it was just me running from something else in my life. It doesn't matter what you did. All that matters is what you do from here on out. <laughs> I know a lot of bookies that would disagree with you, but I feel what you're getting at. So let me get to the point. Throwing in with you has been the best decision I've ever made. It's like I found a part of myself I never realized was missing, which happens sometimes when you're a ghoul. If I hadn't taken up with you, I'd probably be in a gutter somewhere, getting gnawed on by rad roaches. You have been one hell of a friend. Have you ever thought about us as maybe more than just friends? <laughs> Bit that obvious? Come on, you don't want to wake up to this mug every morning. Never wish that on anyone I cared for. Who I fall for is my decision. And I've fallen for you. Wouldn't expect that kind of lapse in judgment from you. But I guess that works out for me then, doesn't it? <laughs> Moments like this, I know all that karma stuff is bull. Because no one like me should be this lucky. Come on, love. Let's get this freak show on the road. <laughs>